Hello, Paul Hamilton from UTB. Big announcement. I've made these light box dioramas just for you guys, completely free. I do a lot of work in the art area and I do a lot of work on iPads and integration with Keynote. So I've made these light boxes. How good are these? You basically download them and then just bring in Keynote shapes, change the opacity of the Keynote shapes and start layering them in the light box dioramas for this beautiful, beautiful effect. So you can just drag them straight from Keynote directly into Reality Composer and you can see the effect. It's just a gorgeous look. I've always loved light boxes and this kind of effect. And now you can, and your students can grab them for free and start your beautiful creations. You can also do things like Keynote drawing. So I'm gonna draw a little bit of a cave kind of entrance to the diorama. So I'm just using the fill tool and I might add some vines just by adding um, maybe a pen tool at the top. And when I finish this, after I've pressed done with my keynote drawing, I can drag that directly onto the light box to give it that beautiful layered cave look that I'm looking for. So if I finish that now, I open up Keynote on a preview screen and I drag straight into Reality Composer. You can see this beautiful effect I'm getting in regard to my light box. And don't forget, you can change the opacity of your Keynote drawings and shapes as well. You can see the tree on the left there. It gives it that beautiful kind of shadowy layered effect as well. These are completely free. Please give us a call out at UTB if you are using them with your staff or with your students, love to see what your creations are. So how do you get to them? Well, I'm putting a link to the Padlet, the UTB AR resource tablet, uh, Padlet at the top here. And basically you go to the first column, art, free USDZ models, select the diorama, diorama box of your choice, click on it. It'll open it up in AR on your iPad, go up to your object at the top, Go up to your share button or your save button, top right hand corner, and save it to files to bring into Reality Composer.